It is July 25th, 2016. You're watching Sorry for Your Luck Video Live. Old school, handheld. It's gonna be a drop. Going to surge. Wow. Really getting in with the surge lifestyle. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Turn off. Howdy, howdy. Y2K checking in. Me as always. Patch 406. What's up, Rob? Aloha. Got a. Uh, drive. Been doing all the drive. Yeah, another trip. We're in the fancy Camry today. Uh, we got a uh, trip report. Top three lists. We were in a little uh, backpacking trip, overnight backpacking trip, uh, three nights, four days, three nights, in the Enchantments, yeah. which is uh, near Leavenworth, Washington. Uh, we were in the Zone 5, oh, zone five. which was the uh, eight-mile lake zone. Uh, we had, to win a, we had to win a lottery to do this. Yeah. So like back in February, you like uh, send me a text say, hey, you gotta get we gotta try to get a get a ticket to this. I'm like, what is it? I don't know. Someone told me about it. I'm like, okay. Oh, did I, I thought I don't remember where we heard about it then. I thought yeah, I thought you heard it from somebody. But anyway, so anyway, somebody put a couple entries in it. Got there one time. So oh. the standard uh we had about three or four of the guys going with us. Oh yeah. Basically. Reservation for six, for four, for two. So. Um. Anyway, do our moments. My list is kind of donkish. Um. Kind of took the easy way out on a few of these. Oh, me too. So, honorable mention for uh, was the plan. The plan. The plan. So. We, neither of us had ever been there. Uh, we had a map, had a few trip reports online that we read. Uh, tried to call the rangers, left a message. Oh. Um, we, uh, we were, yeah, we went and, and talked to a ranger. Anyway, so there was three miles in. There's kind of a fork in the road. Yeah. You can take the short, like one more mile to big to Eight Mile Lake, which is a huge lake, or you can head up to uh, Lake Caroline, which is another three miles. It's like a, and it was a climb. And uh, so, what we wanted to do is we wanted to go to Lake Caroline, then the second day take a day hike up to Windy Pass, come back down, stay the night, go back out to Eight Mile Lake, and then go out all the way. So. On the hike to the the fork in the road, I was ready to to quit. Just go to eight mile, or yeah, go to eight mile. And you said, "Well, we really should we should go up," and I'm glad we did. Yeah, but it was nice up there. It was good. It was, it was not easy to get there, but it would have been much harder trying it the second day. Yeah, I, we couldn't have done it the second day. I mean, it, so we had a six miles hike the first day, about. Uh, about a four or five mile round trip second day with no pack. Yeah. And maybe four miles third day. Uh -huh. uh, four miles today. And yeah. then three miles today. Four miles today. Four or five. So we broke it up. Five miles is about our yeah. our limit. So anyway, it worked out perfect. Yeah, first day was about six. It was uh, like it was five thousand feet of climbing. So it's it was a rough six. With, Coming down. With fifty pounds on your back. Ugh. Yeah, coming down, I was really impressed that we had done it because it yeah. was it was a climb. I don't know how we did. I you know worked out zero. Yeah. We got uh, real lucky on the weather. It was nice and cool that day. Oh. Today it's about ninety five. It's about sixty degrees that day. Yeah. All right, you got an honorable mention? I got a couple of them because I screwed up the list. Uh, honorable mention animals. That's an honorable mention. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Um, do you have some up? Maybe well, like that? Well, I mean, it's kind of my uh, battleship, so... Okay, I'll just leave it there. All Animals. Right. Animals. All right. And okay. then uh, I got a separate honorable mention, which was uh, when we got up to... This really should be the top three, but it's not. Um, 
Lake Caroline the second day. Um, did some fly fishing. It didn't look like it was going to work. And pretty quick after, it was nice because it was hot. We went to hike all day. Yeah. And then went out in the water. It was real cold. It's muddy. kind of sink in. It's kind of gross. Uh-huh. It caught a big, like, It's a pretty good size. Cutthroat. It was the biggest fish by far of the trip. <laughs> yeah. You know, and they're, yeah, they, you can, water's crystal clear, of course. Every lake we, we yeah. came to was crystal clear. The lake, the little rivers. Um, but they look kind of small. And when you get them out, yeah, and they real red on the sides. And yeah, good. Real shiny. That's where they called cutthroat. Yeah, we got that red slash neck. Yeah, real cool. Uh, my number three with dips, speaking of oh. cold water. So nothing I like more than getting off of a hike and then jumping in a lake. And we got to Little Caroline and we waded in, we did some fishing and then uh, I was gonna jump in and man, it was cold. So I kinda, you know, I, I wimped out on that one. But once we got to uh, Eight Mile Lake, first thing we got there, took a dip. Um, then we went fishing and I took a dip. I think I got a total of four dips. Oh, really? I think I got three last night and then took one this morning. We packed up, uh, just getting super oh, hot, yes. sweaty, packing up, taking everything yeah. down. And then you get on the trail hot. So I, I took a dip right before we put my pack on. So that's nice and cool. So that was really nice. It was it was cold. It was real cold. Well, the water was felt yeah, good. Yeah. I only took one full. We had some waiting, but I went one full dip where I went under the water. It was, yeah. It was real good. Uh, my number three is the, the day hike. We went to, to Windy Pass. Just when we got to the top of that mountain, you got just kick-ass vistas. Real good. Yeah. Super, super awesome. Tons of see all these glaciers and peaks. I uh, had a picnic up there. Yeah, it was real pretty. I mean, everything we looked at was really great. Uh, each of the lakes we were at were campsite, right lakeside camp. You know, steep mountains, trees, uh, meadows, a lot of uh, uh, prairie flowers. Mm -hmm. Oh, real good. Babbling, babbling brooks. Tons of wildflowers, yeah. You know, that's with with the hiking. It seems like the hiking part is terrible, <laughs> but most of the time you're going somewhere. Which makes it worth it, and and because it's a hike, not everybody's going to do it. So the donk quotient goes way down. Yeah. So you know you're pretty much you meet pretty good people, friendly people, uh, guys that aren't afraid to go for a walk, and uh, yeah, there's usually a reward yeah. at the end. So that's good. Um, my number two is the weather. The weather was yeah pretty good. Yes, I agree. It, uh, We've had a lot of shitty weather. That's Fast. That was, it was real good. No rain. No, it didn't rain at all. Uh, was, was it real cold at night? The first night was a little cold, but not terrible. Uh, last night was, was uh, you know, kind of... nice, balmy. Yeah. Uh, the hiking, when we did the real tough, tough hiking, it was nice and cool. And uh, it was pretty hot hiking out today, but we were going downhill, so it was manageable. Yeah. Nice clear nights, a lot of stars. Oh, yeah. It's hotter yesterday. Yesterday was pretty pretty hot. Right? Yeah. Uh, my number. Oh, we're on number two. Yeah. My number two is it's the first time I've hiked in a or backpack with the hammock. Oh, Can't right. Get all in on hammocks for years. Right. And I like them, so I. Uh, but at the first night, I had it kind of set up wrong. I got it. They're really struggling with it. I had to get out. I had a couple <laughs> cocktails. Yeah. Kind of gave me a panic attack. I wasn't liking it at all. I had uh, a cocktail or two, so I couldn't really help you too much. But at one point, you like lay in there, and Ken just got my pad, just basically tucked me in. <laughs> <laughs> and it, uh, oh, really? Really set me straight. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 That could have been my number one. That was, yeah. That was pretty good. That, you know, because you get in there and you can't oh, move. Yeah. Sometimes you get your sleeping bag. Yeah, if someone could get in there and get you going. So I thought, yeah, yeah. this is what I would want. So, uh, my number one is wildlife. Lots of good wildlife. Yeah. We we basically hit every hit every man we wanted to, except goats. We did not see goats. 
Uh, when we first started up the trail, this uh, Patch heard this noise, and I just saw this flash go up, and I thought it was like a rabbit or something. And you're like, no, it's a deer. It, it was, was a baby went, fawn. Yeah, went by us real fast, real close. Like you said, he probably spooked the shit out of it. it was, and it, and it kind of squealed as it was yeah. running through. Uh huh. And it was uh, still at its yeah. spots. Uh, and real bouncy, just bing, bing. yeah, yeah, that's true. It would really bounce. It wouldn't really. And then the mom came walking up. The doe yeah. was right there, and uh, they weren't real scared of us. Stopped there, and the the, <laughs> the fawn just really yeah, oh, yeah, head butted her right in the udder and got some milk. That's Looked good. For some milk, got a good meal. On our hike to Windy Pass, uh, we saw uh, start seeing marmots, like one or two marmots, which were pretty cool. They kind of were. You really got uh, into them hot. Great. And then there was this one like rock outcrop. It was like Mar Marmot Mountain. There's like four or five. Wow, was he with them? Just yeah, sitting everywhere. on different top oh, watching yeah. us. Uh, we saw, and then we got to the peak. We heard one chirping at us, kind of whistling. Wee, wee. Uh, caught a couple fish. Had a, had a deer in camp with yeah, us last night. Yeah, a couple, a lot of deer encounters. Little chipmunks. Tons of nice chipmunks. Yeah, did real good on wildlife. Yeah. The number one? My number one, uh, last night, you went to bed. Oh. I really wanted just to stay out and watch the stars at one one time. Right. And it was perfect. I mean, the weather was perfect. It was calm. There was no bugs. Um, it was just right on the lake. Had a cocktail. And then I could just, like, the stars were just popping up. At first, you could just see part of, like, uh, Big Dipper. where the Big Dipper started coming in. And then within about 15 minutes, you could see the whole thing. Yeah, super, super awesome. Huh. Took a leak about midnight. Just yeah, watched the stars for a long time. Midnight, you were up watching stars. Yeah. Wow. I left my fly off so I could kind of look up, look see some stars. So that was kind of cool. I was ready at the egg. All right. Well, that's our tilts. Or no, that's our moments. Come back at you with another video of our tilts. Oh, okay. All right. Take us out. More dancing. More dancing. You have time to do something else. Nice, something cheery. <laughs> All right, adios.